to listen to this. So there was this place that we had, and it was an old amusement park. So it was creepy to begin with. Like you got this Friday the 13th kind of vibe every time you drove through there. And, right. and um, you can you can bait here. You can bait. So what we do a lot of times is we'll before season starts, we'll just drive through and dump corn out on the roads. And there was a lady there. On the very back, like there's their river is the northern is the northern property. There's no line. roads on this place. I mean, you're off the beaten path by miles. So anyway, what I figure she did is she just walked the river, but um and came up. But I asked her like, you know, it's just me and her. There's no road. There's no public road that goes through there. And I was like, is everything all right? And she's like, oh, I'm just cleansing the land. I'm like, what the fuck are you talking? Oh, she said. Yeah, that's what she said. That was her answer. And I said, excuse me? She said, I'm cleansing the land. And like she had all of her shit laid out. I can't remember what all it was. I'm sure it was like sage and all that Bundles shit. Bundles of shit. And I was like, well, you know, like this is private property and I don't really don't know what you're doing here. And she was just really, really weird. And I never, I mean, this is a small community. There's only 1,200 people that live in town. And, and who the pretty, fuck leaves an old lady out in the woods by herself? Andy did. Andy Shaver <laughs> left that old bitch. I turned around so fucking quick. Like I couldn't go past her because like it, it's I fucking and I'm like, I backed that fucking pickup out of there so fast. I'm surprised <laughs> that I didn't knock her over with all the dirt I threw on her <laughs> as soon as I pulled out of that bitch. He would not hardly go to that place by himself after that. And it was great turkey hunting. Great fucking turkey hunting. And now I got to deal with this fucking witch lady that's coming up from the river. So are you would you be more would that give that bothers me more than rattlesnakes do. Yeah, that's kind of odd. That's like walking into the woods and like. Sometimes we had this one place that I turkey hunted and my two buddies that I work with now in Canada, they came out and hunted with me this spring and we're in the middle of fucking nowhere in these woods on public ground. I mean, three and a half miles in and it's just nothing but just up and down bridges and shelves and creek bottoms. And we had this bird that came in from behind us. I wanted to cross the creek before he pitched down. We should have just fucking stayed on the other side. Anyways, the hunt got fuckered. He stood behind us and left. Well, we crossed the creek back up, and the tree that he was standing next to strutting, the son of a bitch had nine skull heads. Ooh. Like, either ones that you buy or just, like, small human heads that. in front of the tree with this cross that had a bunch of Bitcoin logos on it. And then they fucking... This is no shit. And then there was, like... You know what you like you clip uh like those potato chip clippers yeah. that you clip bags, you know, keep, there was shit hanging off fishing lines in front of it with Mexican candles. No way. With the logos on the front, so the crosses and shit. Mm-mm. I looked at Mitch and I was like, dude, fuck this, we're out. Like this is too this is too fresh <laughs> for them to be in the middle of fucking nowhere <laughs> to have this right next to where this Tom was strutting. Yeah, this we I, I can't handle that shit, dude. I- 